Alright, hello everybody, and welcome back to some more shenanigans in Tiny Sasquatch. And where we left off in the previous episode, we of course managed to finish up collecting all the fireplaces, activating every single one of them, and now collecting ourselves some rewards. Now, we currently only have 46 coins in the game. Uh, we still have to explore some more, try to finish up some more quests around here, and uh, of course, open up some more places. But, what I think I'm going to be focusing on is probably getting the bear here, uh, the picnic basket, because he is hungry and he wants it. Oh, hi, the tiny one. Nice to see you decided to wake up eventually. Ah, where are my manners? I'm sorry, Sasquatch, but I'm just really hungry, and you know how I get if I don't eat. If you go searching for food, mind you bring me a picnic basket, please? I know it's a lot to ask, but I'm really hungry. Alright, so we know what quest we need to uh, do here in order to bring the bear uh, a picnic basket. And at the same time, you know what? I may also do a mission for this fella. I think I'm a little bit hungry, so I'm not going to be able to do the chase. Uh, so before I start doing the chase, let me go searching for some food for myself first. We know that we have a little bit of food out of the basket here. This is more like a cooler, actually. I keep on saying basket, but no, those are coolers. Alright, we have enough food. And now we should be able to do one of the races. The first one is going to be pretty easy, so uh, let's Hello? just do it. Hey Sasquatch, long time no see, my friend. Hello? You seem to be missing shoes, though, and I might be able to help you out with a new pair, but you need to prove you're fast enough to deserve them. So, win five racing challenges, and I'll give them to you. Hello? When you're ready, go to the starting point and race to the uh, ranger's cabin. Alright, buddy, we will do. Let's just do a race here. We have not done a race before, so uh... Let us see how this goes. Come on, Sasquatch. We got this, buddy. While I was actually building the world of Tiny Sasquatch here, I think I had the most fun I ever had in the game. I've spent so much time in this one. Uh, it's not even funny. I don't know, me personally, I've always liked creating stuff and... Dreams has given me the tools that I always, always requested. I'm not a developer, right? But uh, I do have a little bit of background in the arts. So creating stuff using visual, of course, apps such as Dreams uh, has definitely been so much easier for me. Because in Dreams here, you actually code, but you code using uh, visual presentations. You're not really typing in the actual code that I can never understand. But look at that. We just finished up another race. Awesome. Oh, and I just noticed another thing you hold that I forgot about. We're going to have quite a few of these races to do, of course, but uh, for now... Here we go. Got ourselves more coins. We got 71. I think I may just make my way back to... Um, over there. Oh, you know what I should do? Hold up. Let me go ahead and have a quick chat with the uh, fisherman. But in order to do that... I gotta go all the way to the racetrack. Yeah, we gotta have a quick chat with the fisherman because we know that he wanted us to have a fishing rod, right? And that is the only way he's gonna talk with us. Leave me alone, Ranger. I'm faster than you, buddy. <laughs> but uh, he's not gonna be slower than you for too long. If you keep on running away, he's gonna get faster and faster. And eventually he will catch you. All right, let's keep her going then. We have quite a few quests to do here. Look at these East Girls passing by. I haven't really created any AI for these vehicles passing by. I just had to uh, record their movement a little bit. It's just a tricky way for me to uh, get them to kind of feel like uh, AI passing by. Just because I couldn't really code the right way of uh, creating AI. But anyway, let me get myself this. And uh, let's keep it going. So, first thing is first, I want to have a quick chat with the fisherman here. Uh, but I am going to have to have the fishing rod in order to chat with him. Because if I do that, I don't have that, he's not going to want to talk to me. So, let me get the fishing rod out. There we go. And now, now mm -hmm. he's going to see it. Finally, a fisherman I can talk to. Mm -hmm. You see, I'm competing with my youngest brothers to see who can catch the largest fish. Mm -hmm. But all I seem to catch here are red snapper fish. Mm -hmm. I hear rumors of a giant larger fish, or legendary fish, I guess, somewhere in the campgrounds, but I have no idea where that could be located. If I could catch me the fish, I would definitely win. Anyway, that's just a legend. Don't you listen to this old man's mumbles. <laughs> that is not a legend, old fisherman. That is definitely not a legend, and I already noticed a bug that I'm going to have to fix. <laughs> I don't know why his name is uh, sticking up there. But anyway, let me keep her going. 
So, now that we have the fishing rod, I'm definitely going to try to go ahead and catch me the legendary fish. Let me get me some fuo at it. And uh, let's keep it going. Now, we also know that there is a vehicle we can buy for 500 coins, but we don't even have that much. We don't even have 100 anymore. Because I had to buy all these tools, right? We have the paddle, the fishing rod, the golf club. We have way too much stuff. So, uh, let me make my way to the legendary fish, I guess. Try to catch it. And uh, finish up another quest here. I want to eventually give my bear the uh, picnic basket because he is absolutely starving. And once I do that, new quests are going to be unlocked. And we definitely want to do that. Alright, keep her going, buddy. Am I going to be able to pass by this guy? I don't think I have the... No, I don't have time. Dang it. No, 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 no. Don't jump at me. Holy smokes, he was fast. Oh, God. Never mind. We got caught. <laughs> Never mind. All right. Uh, let me make my way to the campground then because the uh, fish is going to be right through there. And at the same time, since we do have a little bit of food here, let me try to eat up a little bit of something. And keep it going. Come on, Sasquatch. There we go, buddy. Ugh. Ugh. Jump. Jump. This water is making me super slow. Hold up. Let me shake a little bit. Shake, shake, shake. There we go. We got rid of the water. Perfect. Uh, so, let me go ahead and get myself the fishing rods. And let me catch me a legendary fish. Come on. Come on. No! Stay on it! Stay on it! Dang it, he moved away. Come on, Ligi. Here we go. We got it. We got the legendary fish. Awesome. Good job, buddy. And now that we got the legendary fish, all I gotta do is take it to... The fisherman, the old fisherman. And you return. Oh, another mushroom. Yeah, we're definitely gonna need that as well. Definitely gonna need to come back here and get it. But uh, since I don't have the tools, let me just make my way to the fisherman. I give him the uh, legendary fish. It is gonna take a little bit of while here to get back though, but uh, first of all, shake the water off. I could also, of course, make my way to the fire straight up ahead to dry it up. But Sasquatch is so slow. So slow when he's wet. Come on, buddy. Your fur is all wet. We gotta get you dried up. There you go. You can sit by the fire to dry up. <laughs> oh man, I love this. I actually had some of you guys giving me all this idea about Sasquatch getting wet and getting slow when he's jumping in the water. And that also gave me the idea to use the fire as uh, an ability for Sasquatch to dry up. And I had no idea why that ranger was watching me like that. He did the same thing. <laughs> that was so weird. So yeah, thank you guys very much for joining my live stream as I was creating uh, Tiny Sasquatch here. And giving me all these awesome ideas. To keep on adding more features to uh, Tiny Sasquatch. This has been a heck of an adventure so far. And building the world of Sasquatch has been super duper fun. Definitely going to keep on making more games and dreams. Because I'm having a lot of fun with this. Alright, come on buddy. Keep on going. Alright, so. We know that we got to get back to the racetrack. Which I'm going to try to do right now. Right through here. Come on. Come on, buddy. Keep on running, buddy. Almost there. I gotta try to get myself a vehicle because we are super slow at the moment without a vehicle. But getting my hands on uh, 500 coins, that is not gonna be easy. It's not easy to get rewarded in this game, so uh, every single coin is gonna matter. Alright, grab the coins. Or actually the food, I want to say. And keep it going. And don't mind me drinking a little bit of coffee here. I have spent quite a bit of time last night trying to um, make sure everything is alright for the release of uh, Tiny Sasquatch. And look at that. We got the legendary fish. Hey, you caught the legendary fish? <laughs> I cannot believe it. Go ahead and grab my red snapper as I do not need it anymore. There we go. We got it. So now that we got the red snapper, I got to make my way back to um, the lake. And uh, give the red snapper to the bear. 
or actually not the bear. We gotta give it to the brother. And then I'm gonna be able to get something else from the brother in order to give to the bear. So that being said, let me make my way straight up ahead to the second side of the lake, I guess, where the fisherman is and deliver this red snapper. At the same time, I gotta finish up those uh, bunny races because if I do manage to finish those, I am gonna get myself some uh, fast running shoes. And at least I'm gonna be able to move a little bit faster until I'm gonna be able to get my hands on a vehicle here. Come on, come on. Alright buddy, I got your red snapper. Hey, you brought me the red snapper, did ya? Huh. Well, let's see who wins the competition now. Feel free to grab the green snapper from the table. Little does he know that his brother actually has the largest fish ever. <laughs> but uh, we got ourselves the mission. We got the green snapper. Yes, finally. Alright, in that case, let me go back to the first part of the lake. And deliver the uh, fish here to the bear. Because with that, we're finally going to get ourselves on the picnic basket. We're finally going to get our hands on the picnic basket, I want to say. Uh, you know what? Hold up. Let me try something. Let me try to actually run through this sign. Oh! Dang it. <laughs> He's jumped so high. Thankfully, I did manage to actually dodge him. Oh, no, 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 no. Another... Oh, my God. Never mind. He jumped right in my head. Jeez. These rangers. What do you guys think? I should probably get um, the rangers to deliver you back home when they catch you. Instead of here. Yeah, I should probably do that. Alright, let me make my way to the lake and deliver the green snapper to this fella. Hey, buddy. Got your fish? Uh, say, is that a fish I smell on you? Uh, thank you, Sasquatch. That was delicious. Now, it's time I satisfy my sweet tooth with some honey. There we go. Finally. Alright, buddy. Help me up with the bees here because these things have been super duper annoying. I mean, look at that. They're just gonna start chasing me as soon as I... Oh, God. Nope, nope, nope. Dang it. They got me. Well, that's fine because the bear is making its way here. And hopefully, he's going to keep on busy while I'm going to be able to get myself another map piece and that picnic basket. In the meantime, let me get another coin. Come on, buddy. Get rid of these bees, please. These things are super annoying. And finally, there we go. The bees are going to leave me alone. They're too busy with the bear now. <laughs> Awesome! There we go. We got the picnic basket, we got another map piece, and we are good to go. Perfect. Let me get some food. Oh, you know what? While we're at it, I think we also have the paddle, right? And this fella told us about that tiny duck in the middle of the lake here. So let me get the paddle on. And let me paddle to it. Oh, am I happy to see you, Sasquatch. I've been stuck in the middle of the lake for hours now. I know this may sound strange, but I don't know how to swim. Can I get a ride back? My mom must be super worried by now. Land! Thank you, Sasquatch. There's a chest behind me. You can go ahead and open up now. See you later, Sasquatch. There we go. We've done it. We got ourselves a second check saved. Awesome. We got two out of five. And also, he said something about a chest back here. Yes, there is. Give it to me, buddy. There we go. We got 199 coins, uh, which means... Actually, I cannot get the hat just yet, either. Yeah, we definitely need more. There we go. Uh, we don't need that no more. Well, in that case, uh, I'm definitely gonna have to make my way over there. So, let us see what we got here. Let me try to go ahead and deliver the uh, picnic basket that we got to the bear. Because I have a feeling that is gonna be unlocking more things for us. We most definitely want to unlock more stuff. Uh, you know what? I think I'm actually gonna let this ranger catch me because if I do that, he's gonna fast travel me all the way back home. <laughs> catch me, buddy. You can catch me. <laughs> Did I just lose him? No way, he lost me. You guys have no idea how much I started working on the AI here to try to get him to chase me. I had so many glitches, and you guys can see that I still have a few more bugs that I gotta figure out and fix. But, uh,. At least the game is working. Alright, we're back. Finally back. Let's keep it going then. Uh, so as I was saying, what I want to do here is check the board. Because as I was saying, we do have two map pieces. Look at that. 
Two map pieces have been added to the uh, board. And we have two out of five little ducks. They kind of look more like baby uh, baby chickens. There's one here back home. And there's another one swimming in the water. <laughs> this one is super cute swimming in the water. Look at him. He's enjoying himself so much. Alright, we still have to fight uh, quite a few more though. So, let me keep on going. Let me give the bear the picnic basket that he requested. Hey, buddy. Oh, wait, I cannot talk with him? Hmm. You know what? I think this is a bug here, so uh, ignore this, guys. Uh, what is happening here is that you can actually give the bear the food. And he's going to open up the boulders behind us. Uh, but that should not have opened up until I would have talked with him and gave him the uh, picnic basket. So yeah, this is a little bit of a bug here I'm going to have to figure out and fix. But anyway, once you do that, once you give him the picking basket, you're going to be able to make your way back here. Man. This is a really huge river. Oh, wait. Can I actually walk to the other side? Nope. You cannot. <laughs> Alright, never mind. In that case, let me have a quick chat with this fella and see what he's going to say. Oh, hey, pal. You want to cross the river, do ya? Well, I can certainly help with that, but you see that dead tree behind me? I was planning to cut it down to make a bridge, but I'm missing a saw. Bring me one and I will make a bridge for you. Alright, so um, if I do bring this duck a saw, he's going to chop down the tree for me and maybe make like a bridge so that I can cross to the other side because that is where the mushroom hunter is. And we most of you want to chat with them as I want the tool for the uh, foraging. All right, well, in that case, let me keep her going this way. Uh, while we're at it, let me have a quick Hello? chat with this fella. Very well done, Sasquatch. I'm impressed. Yeah. It's now time to move on to the next stage. Hello? For the second race, you will be heading to the racetrack. When you're ready to go, go to the other starting point. Yeah. And, oh, and uh, do watch out for incoming traffic. <laughs> All right, buddy, let's do that. So he wants me to go to this side of the racetrack this time. And now race up all the way to the uh, racetrack this time. So we're definitely going to do that. I noticed that we also have 200 coins. Not bad. Alright, we have 51 seconds for this one. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We're going, Sasquatch. Don't get stuck. This is not going to be an easy race. We are super slow. I need to finish up these races so I can start getting myself the uh, running shoes. Thankfully, I'm not starving, so that's not going to be a problem. But I got to try to take the shortest paths in order to get to that finish line. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Almost there. Perfect. Five seconds. Four, three. Two, one, and oof, we got it. 50 coins. Thank you very much. There we go. We got it. Okay, okay, okay. Second race complete. Uh, we got another one we're going to be able to do. So currently, I'm happy that I finally, to, finally managed to open up the path uh, to go to the Mushroom Hunter. But um, the duck there said that I need to bring him a saw. So, guess what I gotta do? I gotta make my way to the sawmill somehow. Because I'm pretty sure that's where I'm gonna be able to find the saw, right? So, let's just go on a little bit of a trip here. Towards the sawmill. We are gonna be able to get there eventually. But uh, you guys know that it's gonna be pretty far away. I don't have a car. I don't have a ticket to get myself a bus to get there faster. So, all I'm gonna have to do is just walk. Alright, let me get to that side then. Can I get a ride, buddy? <laughs> Alright. Mountain Pass activated. There we go. Uh, uh. Oh, another dinghy hole. Yes, please. I want to get me all the dinghy holes because I'm just about to get enough money uh, to buy myself that awesome hat. 260. I think I needed 255, if I'm not mistaken. So I'm pretty sure I have enough now. I'm going to be able to get myself the cowboy hat. 
Now, don't expect anything awesome out of that cowboy hat. That is just uh, something to change the look of Sasquatch. That's all. It's not going to give us any abilities or anything. Definitely going to have to make use of the flashlight as well. And you guys know that the caves are the ones that are going to need the flashlights. So we're definitely going to need one. Hey, buddy. Can I ride the bus? Mm. Nah, you need a ticket to ride the bus. Mm. Yeah, I know. I'm going to have to find one. I know, I know, I know. Let me, first of all, give me another dinghy hole. For two more coins. There we go. 270. Perfect. That's what I'm talking about. And this is the path for the sawmill. As you guys can see right here. Alright, let's check it out. Let's check it out. Let's see what we got going on here. Ooh. This area has actually been the second area that I created when I started the, uh, building up the world of Tiny Sasquatch. So the first one was, of course, the house of uh, Sasquatch in the campground. And then I started working on the sawmill. And once I saw that, actually, once I finished this one up, I figured out that I'm actually going to be able to finish up this entire game. And uh, it has been a heck of an adventure so far. Hey, buddy. If you want to buy some wood, you have to wait a bit. It seems that the saw broke and needs to be fixed. Ah, so this entire... I mean, isn't this wood? Oh, it's sold to Mr. Pemberton. Are you kidding me, buddy? Yes, I'm not going to be able to get myself any uh, wood just yet. Hmm. Well, can I go no. through here? Wait, wait, all that text overlapping. <laughs> if you want to buy some wood, you got to have to wait a bit. It seems like the uh, saw broke. Come back later once we fix it. Okay, okay, okay. What about through here? Hey, you can't go back there. Yeah, because the employees only. Hmm. Okay. Well, what if I just turn on this fire alarm? What's it going to do? <laughs> Everybody's going to run away. Ah, does that mean that I can actually go inside? Yes, it does. Nobody's gonna stop me now. And guess what? If I pick this up, now I'm probably gonna be considered an employee. Awesome! Let's stop this. There we go. And now they're gonna come back. <laughs> there we go, buddy. Can I also go back here? Mm. Mm. Get your hard hat on, buddy. Oh! Uh, so now that I have the hard hat, I can go back here. Awesome! Okay, okay, okay. Uh, what about talking with this fella? I mean, he's gonna say the same thing. But going through here now is possible. That guy's not gonna stop us, as I do have the hard hat. If I take it off, he's not gonna allow me. But if I put it back on... Oh, God. Did I just get kicked out by the door? <laughs> Alright, let's go back in. And uh, let me open this up, because I'm kind of starving. Hey, I know I left the keys somewhere around here. Hmm, I'm going to look for them after I finish washing my hands. Interesting. Now, what's the reason of this guy washing his hands? Why are you washing your hands, buddy? Can I open these up? No, you cannot. Okay. Uh, in that case, I'm gonna be guessing that guy was washing his hands because he maybe used the loo? All the way back here to the party? Oh, hold up, there's a key back there. And this door is gonna stop me from going inside. So maybe that's the key that he was talking about. Which... Is it gonna be in the loo? Yes, it is. So that's why he was washing his hands, because he just used the bathroom. Awesome! We got ourselves the key that he was talking about. Let me grab a coin behind here. And with that key, we can open up this one. And get ourselves another key. Awesome! Okay, okay, okay. Uh, and I think this key is gonna be the one that's gonna allow us to open up these lockers in the back. Right? Yes, it is. All right, we got these ones, and then we got these ones. Oh, wait, what's up with these buttons? Well, the thing about these buttons is that you're gonna have to use a specific pattern in order to open them up. So the first button you're gonna have to press is going to be um, number one. If you guys are looking on the side of the locker here, you can kind of see like a bolt on the side of it. So that's gonna be number one. There we go. Next up, we gotta look for bol bolt two. This one has three bolts on it. This one has two bolts, if you look by the flower there. So that's gonna be number two. Number three over here, because it has three bolts. And of course, this is gonna have four bolts, if you look by that flower, which is a little bit more difficult to spot. But, uh, there we go. We got it. It's completed. Alright, now, let me go back. Back on the side of the sawmill here. 
and see what that just unlocked. Because if you go all the way back to this side, you are going to be able to see a cable taking us to a chest. And this is going to give us some more coins. Awesome. All right, perfect. Uh, I did see a diggy hole that I'm supposed to dig up here. So let me grab this one real fast. I'm currently working on getting myself enough money to be able to buy a car. Once I get that, I'm going to be able to traverse this world a little bit faster. Look at that. We have 389 so far. Uh, I also see a mushroom, but I don't have the mushroom things. I do have the forging tools, I want to say. Oh, at the same time, look at that. We got a saw. There we go. That's what I wanted. And we also have the ability to work the sawmill. Hmm. You need to add wood first before starting the saw. Uh, I know, buddy. I know. Uh, you know what? I'm going to leave the saw here for a little bit. We know that we can use it. I'm going to show you guys how to use it a little bit further on for now. Let me get myself a little bit of a coin. That's going to get us very close to nine, uh, 400. Oh, actually, exactly on point 400. Awesome. All right. We are kind of starving, so let me make my way back inside over here to get some food. Come on, buddy. Faster. I don't want to starve to death. Open this up. Oh, get myself a coin. Perfect. And keep on going. All right. We got 401. And I also want to chat with the trash bear over here. What's this guy going to say? Hey, buddy. Oh, hi, the tiny one. Do you by any chance have any trash food on you? Because if you do, I found this bus ticket you might want. Mm, not yet. But uh, now we know that he wants some trash food. And I'm definitely going to go ahead and search for that. First of all, let me see if I can get me more coins here. More coins. 411. And I think I also saw another one back here, which is going to be 412. There we go. We're getting there. We are definitely getting there. So we got to bring this fella some trash, right? Uh, which means I'm going to have to start searching around for trash locations. Definitely going to have to do that. As I still cannot ride the bus and I really, really want to try to do it. I know I need a ticket bus, buddy. I know that. Well, in that case, uh, since we made it up here, let me also go all the way up the mountain. Let's just check the mountain real fast as well. While we are on this side, why not explore a little bit more? Man, the mountain pass is going to have us running like crazy. And we know that we're going to have to do a race up here, right? We are going to have to race all the way to the mountain eventually. So uh, it is good that we're learning at least where we got to get to. Come on, buddy. Almost there. Almost there. Can I go through the uh, log? Uh, yes, we can. Of course we can. Huh. Nothing here that we need, though. But I do see a mushroom I'm going to have to come back for and collect. So, yeah, there's definitely going to be one of the mushrooms that the um, mushroom hunter is going to request. But uh, nothing else we can do here. Not yet. We are going to have to return here for some more stuff, of course. But for now, let me keep her going. <laughs> I love that I can use the uh, hard hat on, paddle, fishing rod. Wait, what? The fishing rod is not activating for some reason. Hmm, why is that? Well, that's another bug. <laughs> so there's another bug that I'm going to have to fix. Uh, because I'm not going to need the fishing rod, of course, to use the rank here. But uh, it should at least show in my hands. All right, let's keep going then. And we have another bus, rider, uh, bus driver. Mm. Hey, you need a bus ticket to ride the bus. Mm. I know. I'm going to get one eventually, buddy. I'm going to get one. Let me get a coin here first. Let me go to the back of the lodge as well. Try to collect another coin. Four hundred thirty-nine. We're getting there. We're going to get a car eventually. GST waits. Oh, hold up. Grab that. That and that. Perfect. And at the same time... Oh, I'm starving. Oh, I should get some food. No, no, no. Hold up. Let me go ahead and get myself a dinghy hole here real fast. Because we're just about to get ourselves 500 coins. Finally, we got it. 454. 
a few more. A few more to go. But uh, let me try to get myself to some food real fast. Because I'm about to starve. Faster, faster. Come on, buddy. Alright, we do see some food over here. Let me try to eat this up real fast. Oh, and I think there is an NPC I gotta chat with. Let me grab this first. Thank you very much. And no way, we can actually do a little bit of a uh, sliding on the ice. <laughs> there we go. And there is another hole that I can actually dig right over here. Come on, buddy. Just a few more coins. We get in there. Woohoo! More coins. We got 464. And I know I left some coins in the igloo. <laughs> this place looks so cool. We even have the big mountain in the back that I'm going to be able to climb eventually. But first, let's collect a few more coins on this side. We got 468. We're getting there. We are slowly but surely getting there. Oh, what's happening? Oh, I'm freezing! No! I'm freezing, I'm freezing, I'm freezing. Um, 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 can I actually shake the water off of me? Because I'm cold. There we go, you can actually shake the water, the cold water off of you. <laughs> Whew, I lost a little bit of health there. But we're good. Alright, let's chat with this fella. Wait, no tickets to buy? Be right back, seriously? Hey, anybody home? Open up! Open up, I want to get some tickets, buddy. Hmm. I ain't gonna be able to do it. No. Psst, over here. Mm. If you're trying to get a ticket, I'm afraid you will have to wait a bit. Mm. Or I could give you a mine for a price. What do I need, you ask? Mm. Well, I'm really hungry and I would love a juicy burger from the diner. Bring me one and the ski ticket is yours. Thank you, dude. Okay, so I'm gonna have to get him a burger in order to be able to ride the ski lift. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Well, that means I'm gonna have to go back to the diner, get myself a burger, and then bring it to this fella. Oh man, but we're so close to 500 coins though. Super duper close. Uh, let me get myself 10 more coins out of this hole. There we go, perfect. And you know what, I'm actually gonna make my way to the diner because... I do need to get myself not only the burger, but I have a feeling we gotta check through the garbage. Uh, every single place we see like a uh, trash can or something, I'm gonna have to look for some trash food uh, for the trash bear. Because if I do manage to give him that, guess what? We are finally gonna get ourselves... Come on, buddy. Move faster. Uh, we're finally gonna be able to get ourselves a bus ticket and ride the bus. We're probably not gonna need the car anymore if I have the bus ticket. <laughs> I'm gonna be able to spend the money on something else maybe. But, uh, let me keep her going. Unfortunately, I have a feeling I'm actually gonna faint eventually, as I'm not gonna have enough time to get back home. I'm kinda starving, and there's no food around here. No, I'm not gonna be able to make it back home. That is gonna be super annoying. Run! Run, Sasquatch. No, no, no. Almost there, almost there, almost there. Please don't faint. Almost made it to the sawmill. Come on. Please don't faint. I don't want to spawn all the way back to the entrance. Here we go. We made it. Awesome. And if I hit faint here, I don't even care anymore. Alright, well, in that case. There we go. Perfect. Let's keep it going. And I'm not going to be able to use the bus as I don't have the ticket just yet. So let me try to make my way all the way into town. Tiny Sasquatch is super slow, but I mean, of course it's gonna be slow. Look at his tiny feet. Tiny Sasquatch and his tiny feet. Of course it's gonna be uh, tiny. And of course it's gonna be slow. But there we go. We made it. Alright, perfect. We made it to town. So, uh, first thing is first, let me look through some trash over here. And see if I can find some food. <sighs> no food in here. Take it. Okay, what about these ones? Any food in here? Just boxes. What about this one? Wait, what is that? A burger? Crap it! There we go, we got ourselves the trash foods. Awesome! 
So now, now if I get the trash food to the bear, he's gonna give me the ticket, and we're finally gonna be able to ride the bus. But before I go anywhere, uh, let me also make my way to the diner. We know we gotta go here in order to get ourselves um, a burger, right? So let us see how this works. Hey, buddy, can I have a burger, please? But first, can I get some food from your fridge, please? <laughs> there we go. Hey there, welcome to the diner, buddy. Yeah. Sorry about this, but at the moment, we are not taking any orders. Uh -huh. We need to finish our current orders first. Uh -huh. And I cannot go deliver them, as I'm very busy. Uh -huh. If there was someone to deliver all these orders, I would be very grateful. Uh -huh. Hmm. Well, guess what? I'm definitely going to be able to deliver the orders. So these are the orders that we can pick up, of course. But what does everybody need? Uh -huh. Hey, where's my soda? My parking meter runs out in five minutes. <laughs> Alright, so this fellow wants a soda. In that case, let me grab the soda. And there you have it, buddy. All right, one mission done. What about you? Mm. Oh, man. I hope my fries are still hot. Uh, hopefully they are, buddy. I have no idea how long they've been sitting here. But, uh, is your fries. There we go. What about you guys? Mm. At this point, it would have been quicker to go shopping for ingredients and make my own burger. <laughs> All right, so this guy wants a burger. Mm. Any news on my maple syrup pancakes yet? My mouth is watering just talking about it. <laughs> All right, so he wants the... Hold up, grab this. The pancakes. Yeah. There we go. And lastly, the burger. I mean, I know I could actually grab this burger and deliver it to that dude at the ski, but uh, this guy's not gonna allow me to leave with the burger, so uh, let me give it to him. There we go. Mission complete. Awesome. We finished it. That was so cool. All right, in the meantime, let's just have a yeah. quick chat with this fella. Whoa, did you just deliver all those orders? Yeah. Oh, you sure are braver than you look. Mm. I wish I was as brave as you. Mm. Anyway, a promise is a promise. Mm -hmm. Here's a delicious burger for all the work that you have done. There we go. We got the burger. Awesome. All right. What are you guys doing up here, though? Look at this fella cooking the burgers. <laughs> Getting all these delicious burger cooking. Awesome. All right. In that case, um, we now have the burger. We have the ticket. I am going to have to start running back to uh, the sawmill again. But in the meantime, hold up. Did I already collect that treasure? Um, not the treasure, I want to say. Did I already collect that thingy hole? No, I did not. So let me make my way back here and get myself the digging hole behind the prison. Which does have an open cell for somebody. 489, just a few more coins. I'm gonna give myself the car. But I really don't know where to look for more cars. Unless, of course, I do more races, maybe. And once I do the races, uh, I'm going to be rewarded some more coins. Yeah. Definitely going to have to do that. All right, anyway, let's keep it going. Hey, buddy. What are you up to? Going to the supermarket? I think he is, right? Yeah, I don't even know. I don't even know. All right, let's keep it going. Um, let me make my way back to the sawmill again and once I deliver the trash food to the bear hopefully I'm gonna get myself the ticket and with that I'm gonna be able to then use the bus to get to different locations a little bit faster but the problem is I'm gonna start be being hungry very very soon again so I gotta hurry gotta hurry come on buddy almost there all right finally we made it man this took so long and I'm, of course, starving, so I'm going to have to make my way uh, inside the sawmill to get some food. But first... Hey, buddy, did you say you have something for me? Hmm, is that some trash food I smell on you, buddy? Do you want to trade? Of course I do! Oh, man, thank you so much for the Sasquatch. This definitely hits the spots. Here's the bus ticket, as promised. Awesome! We're finally going to be able to use the bus now to traverse uh, the world a little bit faster. But before I do anything, uh, let me go... Back in here, using the hard hat. There we go. And get myself some food. <laughs> Finally. Alright. Well, with that done, we can now use the bus and uh, get back to different locations a little bit faster instead of just walking by. Because now, I can easily just tell this fella to take yeah. me with the bus. Where do you want to go? Uh, Take me to the lodge. There we go. Made it to the lodge. Awesome. This is so much better. So much better than just running. 
Well, uh, I think I already got myself the saw, right, from the sawmill. I'm pretty sure I did. Uh, but first, let me make my way to this fella because he's going to give me the ticket to ride the uh, ski lift. And I most of you want that. I want to try to make my way up the mountain. Let's just see how this goes. Jump, jump. Well, faster. Hey, buddy. Mm. Wait, you actually brought me a burger? Mm. What? It's even a little worm. I don't even know how you managed to do that. Mm. <laughs> but I can't wait to finally eat this delicious looking burger. Mm. Here's a ski lift ticket. Now, stand back. This might get real messy. There we go. We got it. Finally. And guess what? We are now going to be able to ride this thing all the way up. There we go. Man, this took quite a long time to get here. Um, the game is not that big as I was saying, but because it does have you running back and forth, back and forth quite a couple of times, you are going to have to spend quite a bit of time in the game in order to fully complete it. But there we go. Made it up the mountain. Finally. And I really see a coin that I want. Because this is going to get me all the way up to 490. There we go. So if I, found a, if I find myself another diggy hole... I'm going to have exactly 500 uh, that I'm going to be able to use in order to buy the car. Although, now that we have the bus ticket, we don't even need the car anymore. But I'm going to buy it still. In the meantime, let me see if we have the mountain hut back here. And the answer is, yes, we do. Look at it. A mystery hut discovered. Hmm. So maybe now that we got this, we're going to be able to do something about it. We have 492. Let me get some food first. There we go. Let me go all the way back here because we do have some more coins and a mushroom. But I still need to get my hands on those mushroom tools in order to be able to start collecting some mushrooms. Uh, let me get you. Hold up, buddy. Give me the coin. And ultimately, the shovel. Now we're finally going to be able to buy the car. There we go. Which I'm most definitely going to buy. Most definitely going to buy that. I found the coins. Yes, please. <laughs> awesome. We've done it. And now, all we can do is just rest up in the water. This has been so cool so far. <laughs> awesome. All right. Anyway, guys, that being said, thank you all very much for watching another episode of Tiny Sasquatch. Uh, we still have quite a few more quests to do here. we got to make our way back home and try to chat with that Doug that I wanted to saw. Because if I give him that, he's going to then be able to build a bridge for me to go to the Mushroom Hunter. And I really, really want to do that as we have quite a few mushrooms around the map that I want to start collecting. But in the meantime, guys, thank you all very much for watching. And stay tuned for the next episode coming up very, very soon. And also, if you guys want to check out this game and play for yourself, you have to have a PlayStation, of course. You have to have Dreams installed on it and just simply play this one for free but that being said guys thank you all very much for watching stay safe and i'll see you all very soon bye